Hi everyone, John Ross here, Product Manager at Trend Micro. Today I will introduce our Vision 1 Fishing Simulation Assessment. This simulation is designed to give you visibility of the human risk in your organization, empowering you with the insights to mitigate that risk through follow-up security awareness initiatives. To get started, click on Assessments, Security Assessments, and then click Start Assessment in the Fishing Simulation Assessment tile. There are four steps required to launch your campaign. Firstly, you need to select your fishing simulation template. You can choose from a variety of real credential theft phishing attacks that have been detected by Trend Micro and turned into a training exercise here in Vision 1. You can preview the template to see how it will look when it arrives in the inbox, and you can also edit the sender name subject and email content to make it more relevant to your company. You can also preview and edit the landing page to suit your requirements. Once you are happy with your selection you can move on to step 2. This is where you will define who in your organization will receive the simulation email. There are three options to choose from. The first option is manual entry where you can type in the email addresses of those who should receive the phishing simulation. The second option is a CSV file upload. To use this, download the CSV template and add your data. The final option is third-party data integration. You can connect your Azure AD, on-prem AD or Okta and import the employee data. You can then choose the employees to include in the simulation from the data that has been imported. Please note that you can only send to up to five recipients when you first access the phishing simulator. This will be ideal when testing delivery and reporting from your campaign. If you want to send to more than five recipients, you need to verify your domain. To do this, click on Edit Settings and follow the domain verification instructions to add the unique text record to your domain host. Once you do this, the phishing simulator will automatically detect the text record and verify your domain. This will remove the five recipient limitation. When you have selected your recipients, you can move on to step 3. In this step, you can define the end date of your campaign. After the end date, Vision 1 will no longer track clicks or data entered in your phishing simulation. It is very important that you add the Vision 1 phishing simulator sending domain, IP addresses and URLs to your allow list to ensure the emails get delivered. You can visit our online help pages to find out more about configuring your allow list. In step 4 you have the option to configure a follow-up notification to be sent to the recipients who are fished in your simulation. The email is sent on the end day of your campaign and highlights the telltale signs of a phishing attack to the recipient. You can customise the content to suit your own requirements. When you are happy to launch, click Create and the phishing simulation emails will be sent. You can monitor the progress of your campaign and quickly identify the individuals who are most vulnerable to a phishing attack. You can use the filters to narrow down the results of your campaigns. All the data is available to download in a CSV file should you wish to do some further analysis. We also recommend that you complete a mailbox assessment to identify malicious emails that have already been received. 
I hope you find Division 1 Fishing Simulation Assessment helpful in your mission to identify and mitigate the human risk that exists in your organization. Thanks for watching.